What game is Fred playing with me these days? At the time, I thought I have successfully escaped from the people after my life for my rascal eat on campus. Here am I, let dick into a wave of crying that got us more in trouble and after me and Mr. Kenneth in the first place. From what I've heard so far, it was my family, Ibrahim, whoever he is, blackmailed like him and the rest of Ito Reckon. It was my biological father and my mother. It was my biological father they killed. And it was my stepmother they made blind, they barely blind. And it was step brother, step brother they set up and from the look of things, Igwe wants him convicted and found. He's got punishing me. Come on, 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 Good day, Your Majesty. What did you find out? It is true. The young man is living in the chair in Wa's house, as we speak. But from the look of things, the family has already accepted him. No. That must not be. I will not accept that nuisance of the surprise springing up to spoil everything for me in this late in the scheme. No. Never. How do you want it handled, Your Majesty? We must go. He has to die. Make it look like uh, he voluntarily left. Because of the crisis he found upon his return. Let him leave note behind to that effect. I will get it arranged quickly, Your Majesty. You better do. And last month, what update? My man is on it. He promised to give me results when I called him last night. I don't want surprises. I want Osmond dead. And I want the evidence when it happens. 
I blame his mess on you. You failed to anticipate it. And you failed also to master up things to stop it. That's what I pay you. And that's what I'm keeping you for. Success and failure have prizes with me. You have received prizes for various successes. The prize of failure is dire and deadly. You must live up to it. Rise up and be sure that you don't get caught by it. If you love yourself. I'm not bluffing, Stanley. I don't bluff. Just coming from the hospital. The DNA test, which he himself paid for. Confirm that he's our brother. What? Believe me, I did not come back here to make any trouble with any of you. I am sorry that rather than being a pleasant surprise to you people, it turned out to be an added emotional burden. Please, lessen the burden for us. Go away. Just, just go away for now, please. It's too late, Nancy. How do you mean? He can't go now. Our uncles, Ichirodeko and Masichike, told me yesterday that if indeed he is who he says he is, then his coming back has complicated issues for us. I, as a woman, can no longer dispose of any of Papa's belongings. They are now trying to own the properties. That's not possible! He is not... Oh God! Please God help me! Help me! I don't really understand how you feel right now, Amize. You do? Yes, I do. Well, I'll be going back to the village tomorrow with Chum. To do whatever necessary to raise the money to get you out of this place. The test shows that he is indeed my brother. You are welcome home, my son. Uh, you are welcome in our midst, my dear. Thank you, sir. Uh, that is why we called for another family meeting. My husband, their father, my late husband, and your cousin has to be properly buried. <coughs> And a good lawyer hired to handle our reasons case. Akose, you don't have any money. It requires money. My name is Kamasisi, Kamatolo. You don't have anything at the moment. So that is why I also decides to dispose some of my husband's property. So that we can do something about it. But 
we decided to involve you to know how to go about it uh, without falling foul of your customs and tradition. Uh, wise thing you stop to ask. Um, unless the properties are first shared, or oh, it's only the first son that has the right to sell them. With the concepts of other sons, so. however, the property sharing cannot be done without the physical presence of the other sons of the disease. That is how it is. Uh, uh, Arunze authorized me to make the sale on his behalf. No, he can only do that with the family offer in his hand, at least with one of us. The elders of the family as a close witness. My elders, if you're all ready, we can proceed to the police station to get the authorization needed. Wait, if Arise does that, it means that he has relinquished the right he has as the first son of the family. At leaving all the properties to kill him until the ritual is uh, reversed. In other words, all the properties now becomes Kelly's to do whatever he wishes. Kelly. God forbid I should face anything above my brother's freedom or any good of this family, now or in the future. Adak and the Choma. You said you never abandon us, Where are you? My mother and I would take any risk to get Arunze out of that place he's in. Mm, okay, that's okay with me. I will go with you. In my hand is the offer of our father and ancestors. Our people's symbol of truth, justice, and brotherhood. As the first son of our father. In Uwa, I remain the rightful holder of the families of four upon his death. Now, in the presence of our kinsmen, well represented by Ichio Deku, I temporarily hand over this offer to you to enable you take care of some of the family's emergencies that my incarceration could not allow me to do by myself. With this, I empower you to dispose of any of our late father's property that you deem necessary to help you carry out your task. This arrangement automatically ends the moment I come out a free man. If you agree, kiss the offer. to me or any member of our family is your direct responsibility. This appointment is not an option. Both the living and the dead are watching you. God is watching you. Don't worry about me, Arisa. I am a man of God. I will never disappoint you. Thank 
Okay. Uh, when your father and I came back to this village, they had all the families' portions of land surveyed and registered at the State Ministry of Lands. Even this house and the land upon which it stands before the elders of the family, I officially hand them over to you. Yeah, uh, wait, wait, our wife. With what Arinze did today at the police station, it means that Kelly here is the only person who can keep every document pertaining to his father's property. In that case, you will have to release all, not just some, to him. Eh? Hmm. Uncle, look at that. That is what our tradition is saying. And we have to work according to our tradition. Chama, uh, don't worry. What is with me is with all of us. To me, this is just a ceremony. It changes nothing. Please trust me. Trust you? I don't understand. Trust you in what the family has left. In just how many days of meeting you. Oh dear. Listen, I may be in a tight corner, but I am definitely not naive. Alright. Sorry to disappoint you. My mother hey, and no. I. Go and get me the rest of the documents. No. Please, I apologize on her behalf. She's emotionally unstable at the moment. Please, do be on her. Everything to the young man. The final decision was made few hours ago. They are looking for buyers for their portion of lands. Ah, uh, Igwe, as I'm speaking to you now, in fact, the young man is in possession of the document of every land they know I had. Igwe, you know, yesterday, you ordered me to inform you of any happenings in that family. That's why I rushed this morning to intimate you of this new development.
Exactly. Do it. Why? Put the fear of you in him. You know what I mean? If we even saw you, who are you referring to? Your Majesty. Is it a new worst returning song? Don't tell me he's already mad for elimination by you. The information he just brought has earned him a few more days on earth. Yeah. Okay. Uh, now, I want that land they are offering for sale. Uh, 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 you want to buy them? Yes. Uh, you and each other will do the transaction for me as soon as the land papers are signed he will join his father hey. Hey. Fire on the mountain is now a raging blaze. You have just been hit by a deadly brush with its merciless. It is no more a tale. Yes. The big decision. The big decision time has come. And it is now. And here. This is the moment. Yes, come in, come in. Good day, Chief. Good day, sir. Yeah. Who are you? Uh, Chief, my name is Ken. Uh, my uncles, Ichi Odeku and uh, Mazi Chiki, told me to come here that you'll be interested in the land my family is. Oh, 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 oh. Do you return me son of Enua? <laughs> you are welcome, my boy. You are welcome. Mm -hmm. Oh, please have your seat. And uh, you can see what you are doing. Help yourself too. Mm -hmm. No, Ichi, I, I don't drink alcohol. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> you are welcome. Oh, uh, Ichi, like I said, my uncles told me to come if you would be interested. With regards to. The properties your family is putting up for sale, right? Yes, Chief. You couldn't have come at a better time. With me here is Mr. Daniel, the operations uh, manager of uh, the construction company. Uh, the government has just uh, awarded uh, a contract uh, to his company to construct uh, a road. Uh, passing through the kingdom into a uh, modern highway. Mm. He's here on behalf of his company, looking for a place to uh, buy and use as operational uh, base. Uh, Mr. Daniel, this is the young man I was uh, discussing with you a while ago. Yes. Nice meeting you. Thank you very much, sir. Right. Thank you. Uh, we are young man. I am interested in the properties. Uh, there is a proposal that this young man, Mr. Daniel, will want to discuss with you first. I must warn that unless you agree uh, with the proposals, I will not be interested again. 
uh, Mr. Daniel, please. Yes, Mr. Kelly. He has already taken the ones we agreed to sell, nothing more. He has already taken the papers to his lawyer and I made him understand how urgent it is and uh, he has agreed to make payment tomorrow. Hey, that's very fast though. Okay, I'll go with you tomorrow to collect the money. In fact, I will want to collect the money myself. Uh, Ichi Ozala insisted that the transaction will be completed at the Igwe's palace and he said he's going to be the principal witness. Uh, from what he said, uh, I don't know how true it is and he said you've been barred from entering the palace. Yes, and he equally said even if the Igwe changes his mind and allows you to enter the palace, seeing you, he's going to back off from the ongoing transaction. Okay. That's my husband's best friend you're talking about. Mama, yeah. your husband's best friend insisted that I must sleep with him before he renders help to us while you were at the hospital. Oh my God. You finish here, Ozala. Hi. Don't worry, ma'am. Give and take. By tomorrow, we'll have three million in our hands. With such amount of money, I believe the way out of this mess will be wide open for us and our reason. Okay, well, if His Majesty and Ichozala do not want to see me, so bad it all. But I maintain that I will follow you to go and collect the money. I may not enter the palace with you, but I'll wait for you by the outside. What can I do, Mama? I don't know. I just know that I will follow him. For agreeing to grace this transaction with your royal presence as my witness. Um, I know you have always been a very close friend to me. But this is one honor from you that I will always appreciate until the day I die. Um, Mr. Kelly, you said you want the money in U.S. dollars. Yes, the chief. Yes. My is in that bag. Confirm it. Thank you, Your Majesty. I appreciate it. Confirm my as well. Thank you. 
Shoma, my apologies to Arizi and your mother. I know how wrong what I'm doing is, but I have no choice. I'm already on my way out of the country with all the money I got from the property sale. Do you understand why I do it someday? Bye for now. Money, Your Majesty. I'm finished. My, Your Majesty, what are we going to do? Complete the transactions ourselves. Oh, Your Majesty. See, the idiot, the idiot left the original property documents. He left them in his, in his, in his, sorry. Just keep with the money. 
how we need to is uh, infect some forgeries. Infect some forgeries here. Infect some forgeries there. Good! The properties are ours. You see? Didn't you hear him say he was traveling? That means he did not just do for us. He also duped his family. Your Majesty, what if he comes back and exposes us? I mean, he did not leave any signature statement for us to work with Your Majesty. I mean, how can we watch something that we've not seen before? See, I don't know what you're thinking. But for me, I'm not going to let go that $40,000 he took from me. I don't know what you're thinking. But if it has to do with my losing my $40,000 to that Nikon poop, no, never it will not happen. As for you, you can lose your $13,000 to him, never belonged to you. It's company's money, that's good for you. As for me, my money is gone. So, the properties are mine. Your Majesty, my question is simple. What happens if he returns? He dies! He dies if he returns. That's what happens if he dares to return. No one does what he just did to me and lives to tell the story. No one. Okay, but who will help us to sign the documents, Your Majesty? Lying so that he can buy himself some more time for a perfect escape. Arisen, that is no consolation in this situation. Don't we even need to buy more time? I mean, even if he was lying, what money do we have to launch a man for it? We don't have money. We're finished. We are done for. Where are you? 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 Where are you?
Why didn't you at least inform us, this case man, when he made that request? How can you agree to buy all of anyone's pieces of land just like that? Eh? What do you think His Majesty, Diigbe, and her people will make of? Uh, my, my please, take His Royal Majesty and our people out of this. Odeko, you know me very well. I care less about what people will make out of my ashes on issues of land, provided I did not break any new law, as is the case here. Yes. Come on, gentlemen. Arise's case is a no win case. It is watery. Hmm? His family is obviously refusing to accept that fact. They are so desperate that left on their own, they will not stop selling their properties because of him until everything is gone. And I want to ask a question. In whose house would you want your brother's parcels of land to be? In the hand of a total stranger? Or in the hand of your childhood friend? Which one? In my own opinion, Odeku, I would say that both ends are evil. Hmm? But the condition with what Mazia Osana did is evil. But the evil is lesser. So you concur with him? Eh? No, it's a, it's a lesser evil. Oh, good. Thank you very much, Ichechike, for now appreciating that fact. Enuma was a very close friend of mine when he was alive. But I didn't know that that boy would run away with the huge sum of money. I would have insisted in paying that money into Arinze's bank account. But I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. I see crisis for that family. I see bigger crisis for them. And that brings me to why I called both of you here. To rub minds together. Eh? As men of like minds. Give me one minute. One minute. One minute. One 
Thank you. One minute. What for? For seeing reasons with me on this issue. Eh? my head. Injury that I sustained while they were forcing us out of my father's compound. <laughs> my father's compound. Look at what they have done to the daughter of the compound. <laughs> the daughter of the family. Look at my black mother. Look. Look at what they have done to your own family. Joma, now you please stop the morning and tell us where you say you are coming to our houses to meet us. <coughs> it's you, Dick. Ajoka, we don't have all the day here. We say whatever you want to say, our ears are listening. Hey, Joma. Shoma, I didn't know the Ichi Odeko and Ichi Chike. I didn't know the ones talking. Mm -hmm. Eh? Calm down. It's will be. My uncle. Biko. We have come to you for help. Mm -hmm. Biko. Biko. You know my yaka. Go. Please. Help us and beg Jesus Allah. Beg him and the company to return. Uh, can't us off any such arrangement? Hmm. What? Yes. Yes. Can't us off anything that has to do with your family and with your problems henceforth. Yes! Isn't it obvious that the new people are us? I don't want my family to be infected by the cause. Stay away from me and my family for now. If you love yourself. <laughs> We are alone for now, Mama. Mama, are we really close? I, 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 I don't know. Are we? Are we, Chama? What are you people? What have you come to do in my house? It chills her. I cannot see you anymore. Doesn't that touch you? Oh. It is a pity. Then have pity on me. Have pity on your best friend, blind wife, and the family. Uh, that is why I gave that money to your that young man, Kelly, to take care of your problems. What else do you want from me? In exchange for all the portions of land my husband had, how could you call that pity, Ichi Oza? The company that bought our compound, I also heard they came to you. 
Deny it. Deny it, it's your sir. I was only trying to help all of you. I was only trying to help you people. I was only trying to help. Ichi, it is not my voice that you are hearing. It is the voice of grief. The voice of my late husband, your best friend. Ichi, if my husband was given a chance to make a preparation before his death, he would have handed us over to no one else but you and His Majesty. Please, I beg you, have mercy on me, the blind widow and the orphan before you. Please, I beg you. How? Return at least half of our land to us. Prevail on the company that bought our compound to vacate so that we will move in immediately. That is the only thing I ask of you each year. Mm. Okay, agreed. But you get the money I paid uh, for the land you are referring to. And the one the company paid for the compound. You get all of it. And uh, you will get all your properties today. Ichi, Ichi, Kelly has disappeared with all the money. Mm -hmm. What fault of mine is that? Hmm? You find him and beg for mercy, and not me. Ichi, please. We just need somewhere to stay. Pico. Ah. There is nothing impossible in getting a place for you both, Joma. <laughs> but you see, my demand still stands. What? Ichi! What? What demand? Don't tell me it's true that you want to sleep with Choma. What about that? No, tell me, what about it? Is she not a full-grown woman? Just like I am a full-blooded man. And no one! My grief and tears and rise. No Let there be no peace for the man before God, us today and the rest of his Can't life. A woman, your life is already the opposite of peace. What of you? Get out of my compound now. Get out. Oh, no. 
What is happening here? What is happening here? Yeah. Second shot. Somebody will drop dead. Mama. Mama, let's go where I'm going. Mama. I have been informed that there are people occupying a section of your classroom, turning it into their bedroom. Yes, Your Majesty. The ladies are... I know who the women are. They are constituting a nuisance to the children of that school who are from this community. Throw them out. I should throw them out? Your Majesty, they are occupying an empty classroom. And it is far from where children use. I, I actually have pity on them, allow them to use the place. When they came to me complaining that. Are you by any chance trying to defy me? No, Your Majesty. Are you defying the Igwe of Yube? No, Your Majesty. I was only. Mr. Headmaster. If by nightfall those women are still in that school, you will lose that primary school and your career will be in jeopardy. I do not hand out empty threats. Go and do my, my instruction. Sorry, I'm a just Yeah,
Wait, 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 Shoma. Um, tell me, where did you finally erect the house? Ma, the same place I told you now. Shoma, come. Don't go anywhere. Shoma, a house built on the forbidden land? Shoma, a place where the shrine of a destroyed fetish god used to stand? Mbana. Take me out of here, Choma. Mama. Mama Pico. This is not easy for me. It's not. The Igwe I have told you issued a royal decree barring everybody from Ihube land from ever accommodating us. In compliance, everyone has rejected us. Including our own church leaders. I had no choice. I had no other option left than to put up this place with the materials I got from the neighboring community. Seeing that this place is the only place where the Igwe cannot determine what happens in. According to our traditions, only the chief priest has such powers. And he is not yet back to the kingdom. Mama, see how God works. It was a Mecca the madman that came from nowhere. Saw me struggling to erect this place and started helping me without being asked to. Till we finished. He neither behaved like a madman, nor said a word. And when we were done, he left, still saying nothing. What does that tell you? Is God not great? Are we not serving a miraculous God? I mean, if God can use a madman to give us accommodation, after all we have been through in the last couple of days, but what the best we can do is to gratefully move in and make use of what has been given. Stop, Chama! Stop it! What is all this for? I will never. I will never live in a place set aside for the gods. Why you came up with this idea yesterday? Shoma, I told you. I told you that this place belongs to the spirits. Are you not afraid of... No. I am not afraid. But I am tired. Am I not tired? We are tired now. Oh, we couldn't... Mama, let's go inside, oh? We don't have any other choice. Mama, look. It looks like it's about to rain. Would you rather we sleep in the cold again? As has been the case in the last couple of days. Oh. If it rains, it promises to be a heavy downpour. Really? You know what? No way, no way, no way, no way. Igwe, it will never be well with you. Ichi or Zara, Kelly, and anyone else that has a hand in reducing me to this, God will punish you all. Help us, Lord. Can't you see the pain we are feeling? God, hey, 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 Chuku. How on earth can we raise fifty thousand naira 
in this our present condition. How? Chukwu kike. Chukwu no be a bele biano. Pikonu. Mama. I have been thinking since we left the courthouse. Perhaps if we can start some form of enterprise where income will flow in from, it will go a long way. Enterprise? Yeah. Huh. Sure, ma. Mama. Are you looking at your partner before thinking about all that? Your hungry, blind mother. What can this partner do? Mama, you can make brooms. Can you? I mean, you can make brooms for sale, even in your condition. Brooms? Yes. Yes. Yes, I can. Okay. Then let us make brooms for sale. The money might not be a lot, but small, small will be gathering it. You are right. But what quantity? Can we be able to produce daily that will give us the amount of money we're talking about? I don't know, Mama, but anything is better than not. No one can help us, God. Anything is better than nothing. Choma, there is one more problem. Where do you think we will get the raw materials from? Mama, they say where there is a will, there is always a way. And in this situation, the will is not lacking. That means I cannot suffer for what he knows nothing about. Humban, we won't let that happen. Yes. Yes, my son, Arunze. You will not suffer for what you know nothing about. You will not suffer. Oh, poor Kike. Poor Kike, Biao. Don't you even dare to lie about it. Choma, after me, you remorselessly went back home to do the same thing to Mama. A blind widow. How dare you? Freedom. You want the freedom to go away and then what? You stop it. Stop for a moment and think. If freedom from the crisis in our family is what I desire, why would I want to kill any of you to achieve that? I mean, as a citizen, go to any big city, join this girl that live properly and live life on the first place without any. Without killing us, we will be a big scare on your conscience wherever you go. The thought of us will never allow you to enjoy your freedom. That's why you did it. Deny it. Deny it, Chama. Assuming you were right, which do you think will be the biggest scare to my conscience? Abandoning both of you? Okay. Or killing my own blood brother and my mother. 